Wow, hello my people. Thanks for subscribing to my channel. Your wish has always been my command. Thanks always. Well, meanwhile, this is another one. All right, this is another one. All right, on this one it says we have video of soldiers leaving Bonny camp until they got to Lekki, Reno, or Mokri. Okay, the news in detail since the Lekki massacre. This present administration have received heavy knocks from the masses and the international organization alike. However, the only question that seems to be on the lips of every Nigerian is who gave the order. The state government in a bid to give justice to protesters who lost their lives to the sad occurrence set up a judicial panel of inquiry to look into the issue however a lot of statements and counter accusation have been made since the inception of the panel recall that few hours ago the lcc boss claimed that the cctv camera was recording all events until 8 pm during the lekki massacre meanwhile eyewitness and videos fact claims that the cctv camera was removed and the light was switched off on that same day before soldiers unleashed mayhem on defenseless protesters in that same vein the attorney general of the federation malami ruled out the possibility of soldiers attacking the protesters he opined that hoodlums parading as soldiers might have carried out the lucky shootings a lot of people did not buy the story and the reason for that was not far-fetched the chief of army staff initially denied the involvement of soldiers only to later admit claiming it was an order from the state governor it's the reno mockery had tweeted and it's according to reno mockery at reno or mockery says if the Attorney General of the Federation expects Nigerians to believe that hoodlums wearing fake army uniform perpetuated the hashtag Lekki massacre of peaceful unarmed hashtag NSAS protesters, then he is unfit for office. We have video of soldiers leaving Bonnet camp until they, they got to Lekki. Okay, and uh, Reno Moki, in his usual manner, threw a salvo at the Attorney General of the Federation, Abubakar Malami. He tweeted that he was unfit for office. Furthermore, he stated in clear terms that he is in possession of videos showing soldiers moving out of Bonnet camp till they got to the Lekki toll gate in case, or in, in case any CCTV recording may want to prove otherwise. Reno Mokri has been releasing videos to substantiate claims that soldiers were responsible for the Lekki shootings. This time around, he is in possession of videos revealing soldiers moving towards the Lekki toll gate from Bonnet Camp. How true is this claim? Contrary to popular belief, do you think hoodlums, not soldiers, attacked protesters at Lekki on that fateful day? All right, that has been said so far. Well, a lot of people will definitely attest to this. But before I you know, read some comments right now, I have to say something. You see, when we talk about Nigerian security and when we talk about our well-being, everybody is aware already that as far as this country is concerned there is no truth there is no truth from any of these people and as it stands as i tell you right now nigeria needs prayers yes nigeria needs prayers because now people on top don't want people from people that are down to get to the level to which they are and this has no, as it has been as a result of the fact that they are selfish, they are enjoying what they are getting, and they don't want anybody to enjoy the same way. And I can also term this to wickedness. 
they believe that they can be there forever, of which it is very impossible for them to be there forever. Now, the wickedness has now gone viral to the extent that nobody wants to tell the truth. Because they know that if they tell the truth, a lot of things will be taken from them. And they don't want things to be hijacked from them. As in the good things they've been enjoying, which is a very, very wrong thing and which is very bad. Nigeria already knows who, who and who we are. Who and who have uh, as the love of the country at heart? We already know that. We don't need a sister to tell us this. Well, it's only God that will save us. And thank God for somebody like Reno or Mokri, who is very straightforward and is telling out the way it is. All right, and it is said it is also it is gathered here by some. I, I have some comments here right now. Laje on this one has said that the likes of Malami in a country like Nigeria are just opportunists whose breath is to protect their personal interest. It doesn't matter what happens and who is affected. People like that should never be trusted with lives of innocent people. How can a whole, how can a whole attorney general of federation takes the matter of killing harmless protesters so lightly how much effort did he put to find out the real fact oh it's yoruba guys that died and not his Hausa people mind you this is planting of a wind and you are bound to harvest wild wild wind you are bound to harvest wild wind one day just sit down for chair in Abuja. They tell us what happened in Lagos. All right, that has been said so far. Well, hmm. well, Nigerians have been saying that this man should prove his claim eh, to Nigerians that these people that actually perpetrated this evil were hoodlums wearing soldier uniform. Well, that is that anyway on that one. Well, meanwhile, Ono, ono Wagwa Peter has said that, are you sure that the Attorney General of the Federation will not be another Abakiari? Hmm. That's another question. All right. The truth of the matter is everybody understands what's going on. Well, if we say we should just be, you know, asking ourselves questions again, again, and again, we are, we'll just be wasting our time. The truth has been revealed, and in no time, these people will be put to book and that is one thing nobody is bigger than god you cannot escape it you are not bigger than god and then we our, our prayer is that the soul of the departed one will haunt them till they they are put to book and they will all regret what their actions have been so far and that is it on this one meanwhile let me have more take from you on this and remember to subscribe for more updates thanks and god bless